Hi, I'm Elizabeth Pierce, and I'm the founder of SimSoil, and we are participating in Hack the Bay and Delta to encourage people in the Bay Area to become small scale farmers with the help of the local carbon network. I think most of us at this point, especially in 2020, are contrasting the world we see with the world that we would like to be living in. And the local carbon network is a way that you can help move the world towards what you want it to be. In a forest, plants are sequestering carbon. And we're all aware that the excess carbon in the air is part of what's creating climate change. So to mitigate this and to improve the health of the soil, and to improve the flavor and nutrient density of food, small-scale carbon farming is a, a mitigation strategy. The average American household throws away enough food scraps that you could be sequestering one ton of carbon by converting this to a powerful compost. Now, before you say, I can't do that, let me point out that Food scraps are notoriously difficult to compost. You have to get it right and you have to balance it in the way nature works. Think about it. In nature, you never see piles of banana peels or apple cores or coffee grounds. Rather, you see a variety of materials that have been mixed in, and that's what the local carbon network provides for. On a monthly basis, you get a box similar to a CSA that contains all the materials you need to compost your food scraps into a powerful material that's actually better than what you could be buying at your local nursery. The package contains woody material. Most food is high nitrogen, and to actually have effective composting, you need to blend carbon material and uh, nitrogen material. It has a catalyst, a stimulant. This is the sky carbon biochar, and this encourages the biology that's in place to be more active. And then we have an inoculant, so you have the right bacteria and biology to start, and a finisher which brings back in the complete soil food web. Now, 200 years ago, people thought that all plants needed for their nutrition was NPK, and the whole fertilizer industry has grown out of this. <clears throat> in the late 20th century, we developed a different understanding where it was more about the soil microbes and how they interacted in a food in real life, this is what it looks like in a microscope. On the lower left-hand side, you can see a nematode. You can see organic matter in the center. You can see a fungal hyphae, the rope-like strand over on the right, and the, the protozoa to the right of that. These are the wee critters that interact with one another. The Local Carbon Network is a package that provides you with the items you need to actually get this going in a compost pile. It's one of four products that SimSoil has for consumers. Our primary focus is farmers and um, larger growers. But for consumers, we understand the importance of resilience or, or victory gardens. We understand the importance of composting and small-scale carbon farming, and we have these products available to you. Your plants will thank you. You'll see a reaction out of the plants fairly quickly as you use this more powerful compost than what you can buy in the store. Again, what SimSoil does is the biology side of it and the fulfillment. So please join us at localcarbon.net. SimSoil is a California B Corp. We are seeking investors, so feel free to reach out to me directly with for, with any questions.